Hello, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Welcome to your end of September. I was about to say June. End of September um, general love readings. I'm also going to be releasing the Will Your Ex Return love readings uh, very soon, so stay tuned for that. Um, thank you guys for liking and subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate it. Also, um, if this does not resonate with you, you can always get a personal reading with me at jenniferwalkerzen.com. All right, let's jump in and get started. Okay, guys, I pre-shuffled the deck only because my upload speed time sucks. Okay, so I'm going to have to work on fixing that. Videos take me, like, freaking forever. Okay. Sagittarius, in your current position, we have the Seven of Coins, which means that you are waiting for something. You've planted something, and you're waiting for the fruits of your labor. You've been waiting very patiently. Um, that's your current situation. Your blockage is the Knight of Cups. This could actually be a person. Uh, let's see what sign this could be. I want to say this is Pisces. I see fish there. So it could be an actual Pisces sign. Knight of Cups. Uh, the romantic type. Or it could just be love in general. You could just be waiting for a knight in shining armor. And that's what you're waiting for patiently. But I don't know. But it's a seven of coins. You're waiting for something. I do feel like this is probably the sign you're waiting for. <clears throat> and that's the blockage right now. So your strength is the emperor. So this is an Aries card. This is a card of structure, building. Um, you know, this person doesn't even have to be married to anyone. They, they're a person that, that's very independent, a business type, that uh, is very organized, relaxed in their, their position. They're, they're established. They're, they're older, probably. Uh, and you can see this, this, this lion sitting there is very team, very relaxed, laid back. <clears throat> This person has everything in control for the strength card. So in the past, your wishes were fulfilled. Maybe that's why you're waiting patiently. Some kind of wishes were fulfilled with this. You had everything you wanted. You were completely happy. So the person coming towards you is the nine of wands. Of, again, I look at this card, you know, they still got their weapon ready. You see that knife right there, and they're, they're ready to, like, you know, go to battle with somebody. They're still kind of, like, in the defensive here, uh, and they've been wounded, you know, with this bandage on their head. So that's the person coming toward you. <clears throat> uh, for the immediate future, you have the, the Six of Wands, which is victorious, like, you know, your victory. Victory after battle, I guess, you know, with this person. <laughs> um, getting recognition for the accomplishments. Um, and then there was some kind of sudden event with this tower. So whatever this sudden event was, you were victorious in it. Um, hmm. Sorry, I was just grabbing a cup of tea. Some tea. Um, your advice is the Page of Swords. So you want to communicate, you know, you want to communicate to this person using your intelligence and your head about what you want them to know <clears throat> for your romantic love life. Something about this person that you don't know that you need to know. This sudden communication that's coming in from them is a little bit out of balance with the two of coins, okay? <clears throat> your wish is the queen of coins this could actually be an earth sign person or this could be a person who is very motherly who's good with their finances who could potentially be a business person nurturing and then your potential outcome you have the king of wands which Sagittarius this could potentially be your card and you could be waiting on uh, someone to have new perspective with the hangman. <clears throat> or you could be waiting on having new perspective. Or there could be another fire sign coming in towards you with the king of wands. But I feel like you're waiting. Because you're even waiting here. 
you could be waiting here as well. Maybe you're still waiting for this whole thing to play out because there was a sudden event and there was communication going on with this person, but maybe this person hasn't really come into the picture as of yet. That's what I'm seeing here. <clears throat> Okay, let's shuffle these cards and let's see, get to the bottom of this, what's going on here. Yeah, I feel like definitely I'm, I'm like looking at this card and I'm feeling like the horse hasn't come yet with the cup. There's definitely communication going on with you and the other person, but there, there, it's not a physical presence as of yet. All right, so let's find out why do we have the seven of coins here? Okay, there's too many cards. Why is the seven of coins here? One card, please, spirit. One or two cards would, would work. So you're building something, you're working on something with the eight of coins. What else is the seven of coins here? <clears throat> Maybe you're waiting on someone to work out their finances, to go to school, to build something. Yeah, you're waiting for your ships to come in to move forward. Okay. Yeah. So... Maybe they're getting your or getting your finances together. Or they're getting their finances together. <clears throat> but you're waiting for ships to come in to move forward. Why is the blockage the Knight of Cups here? Too many cards. Why is the blockage the Knight of Cups here? Something to do with your intuition and waiting again. You're using your intuition to wait for this person, <clears throat> this Knight of Cups. Okay. Why is the Emperor here? You have a lot of burden on your mind that you're trying to complete. So maybe you have your own business. Maybe you or the other person has their own business and they're getting their finances in order and they're trying to release some of their burden before they can move forward with you. <clears throat> Why is the Knight of Cups here? Knight of Cups here is a celebration. It's a happy thing. Why else is the Knight of Cups here? Again, it's something to do with... <clears throat> this is what I'm getting here. The King of Pentacles. I'm getting the uh, Ace of Pentacles. An offer of happiness. So it looks to me like you're waiting for things to turn out in your favor and move forward with this person. Why is the person coming towards you the Nine of Wands? Why is the Nine of Wands coming towards Sagittarius and Moon Rising? Come on, one card. <clears throat> okay. So they have gotten over some issues with fighting because they were in reverse with that. And they are single. <clears throat> so that's good. Uh, so it's interesting that they their their communications a little lopsided, but let's see what's going on. Why is the six of wands here? Okay, too many cards. Why is the six of wands here? Thank you. Fast moving communication. Okay, same person. All right. <clears throat> so you were victorious because you did hear from this person. So why is the tower here? Why is the tower here? Why is the tower here? Oh my lord. Somebody was left out in the cold because of fighting and bad harsh communication and then they were wounded okay again okay <clears throat> hmm. so there was a sudden event in this person's life or your life that brought on this sudden communication with this person hmm. but I think it's their life because see that they have the two coins here 
So something happened here in their life where they decided to just walk away from their situation. They were wounded for something. And uh, they're single now. <clears throat> why is the... Well, let's go to this page of swords. Why is the page of swords here? Oh, my lord. Too many cards. One card, please. Page of swords. Page of swords. One card. Why the page of swords? Sleepless nights. Okay, spirit, if you really want me to. Okay. <clears throat> Something about being happy. With not having an offer, not a solid offer. So you weren't happy. You were happy, but there wasn't a solid offer. And someone had to defend themselves uh, over their wish. And secrets were revealed, which left this person really worried. Or you. Hmm. I think you need to communicate that it would make you happy. And not so worried because of what happened. Um, okay, so let's kind of go through this. <clears throat> let's just play it like this. Maybe you need to communicate to them that there were some secrets revealed and you were kind of uh, stressed out and worried that you actually did wish for them and you defended the situation and the offer that you knew made you happy. <clears throat> but let's get one card on this. Why is the Page of Swords here? Thank you. Okay. So you need to communicate if you don't want this offer then if that's not what you want, then you need to communicate that to that person. Don't leave that person off. <clears throat> that's basically what it's saying. Now we can go to this person. Why is the two of cups here? Why is the two of coins here? Why is the two of coins here? Okay, the two of coins here because they were victorious. They were victorious and becoming single and dealing with their situation. Why is the Eight of Wands here? Because this is something that you don't need. You didn't know about this person that you need to know. They were victorious and balancing out their situation. So why is the Eight of Wands here? Okay, something to do with an Earth sign. <clears throat> so something to do with some kind of solid offer. Because then we have the offer here. So maybe this person is really serious coming in and they have balanced out their situation and that's why they're coming in single with their finances and stuff. Okay, so why do you have the Queen of Coins as your wish? Sagittarius, someone in rising. Why do they have this Queen of Coins here? Show me the card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. Why is this Queen of Coins here? Okay. Well, we have this King of Wands again. But this is your card. This is your card, Sagittarius. So you wish to offer something to an Earth sign. Hmm. You want something serious with an earth sign. Okay, sorry. I didn't mean to take up time. I was just checking that out. Seeing how that vibrated with me. <clears throat> Alright, why do we have the hangman here? Okay, we have the hangman here because you're waiting on this... Uh, you're waiting up to uh, get some kind of uh, emotional thing, some kind of some emotional healing with a judgment card. And uh, then we have this offer again. Okay, so you want to offer some passion. Hmm. <clears throat> maybe maybe you um, your wish is to have a serious situation. And you're waiting because, you know, 
you got this king of cups here. Then we got this knight of cups here. Let me get a little bit more understanding of what this queen of coins is about. Okay. <clears throat> Trying to be strong. Okay, you definitely have some kind of sexual chemistry and a, uh, maybe an unhealthy obsession with this person. Maybe they're coming in here as an emotional sign because of the fact that you, you are feeling them emotionally. You definitely want some kind of healing. You're waiting for some kind of healing to come and happen. Okay, now why do we have this... Let's get it the deck here. Why do we have this King of Wands? Okay, all these cards wanted to jump out. Okay, something to do with some kind of deception, lying. Okay. Why else do we have this King of Wands here? Huh. You want to end some kind of sneaky behavior? Maybe, maybe, maybe this is surrounding. Okay. Let me take a look at this here. So this person ended something. They ended some kind of out of balance thing. And maybe you're waiting for all that to take place. Maybe that's the other person that's involved. Because we had, if we look back here, uh, you're waiting for things to work out. <clears throat> Let me get a little bit more clarity on this nine of cups. This is a rather confusing reading, Sagittarius. Oh, and you know what card faced up after all those things fell out? Mm, these two cards. Again. So holding on to, sorry, holding on to being single, holding on to your finances, that you are waiting for something to be completed here. <clears throat> now this could be an earth sign person too that you're feeling emotionally but there's still some kind of unhealthy thing here going on okay here's here's my thoughts here's what I think is going on and I'll do some oracle cards on this as well okay because at the bottom of the deck I have the moon card secrets okay so I think you're not involved in any kind of third party situation. I think maybe the person you're dealing with is maybe they decided to end that situation with them. Maybe that's why they've come forward like that. And then going forward, because you're waiting for some kind of ending here still. For some kind of sneaky behavior to stop with the King of Wands. Yeah, because then we have the King of Wands here, and then we have another fire sign here, and then you got this this uh, Queen. So you want this Earth sign. This this is the Earth sign. There's communication going on between you guys, but <clears throat> there still may still be going on with them and something with another person. Uh, you're waiting for a reconciliation with this person. So that's why you got the hangman here, and then you have this king of wands coming in. This is probably the other person that this other person is dealing with, this earth sign. Wow, this is a very confusing reading, Sagittarius. I hope that you can give me some enlightenment on what's going on with your situation. I'm going to get some general advice on this. I feel like I got a big mess of cards right now. Normally, you guys are pretty straight up, too. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. You guys are, are always a good reading. All right. Give me some general advice about Sagittarius. Please give me some clarity on what's going on with all this. Please. General advice about Sagittarius, about their love life. Any kind of general advice that you have for me, please. Guardian angels, ancestors. Help me out of here. Give me some general advice. What's going on. Wow, lots of going on. Okay. All right. So, yes, 
Obviously, we realized we had something to do with finance and career. Uh, again, similar cards is another sign. Releasing an X. I can see that here. Uh, a new love. So this person coming towards you, you're waiting on this person, and you're trusting that the situation is calling you to have faith. There was another sign that this, this came up with. God darn it, which sign was it? I don't remember. You cross watchers will have to know. You know what? Let me um, throw a cross watcher card down here and see. Uh, what do the cross watchers need to know about Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising for the end of September? What do the cross watchers need to know? Show me a card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. What do they need to know? Okay, so they need to know. You need to know that that Sagittarius is making a decision. So they're going to make a decision on the situation. Obviously, they're going to communicate something. Okay, uh, Sagittarius, thank you so much for watching. Um, if you did like this, please like and subscribe and hit the bell button if you want to hear when more videos are coming out. I'm also going to be releasing um, Will My Ex Return readings for the end of September as well. Uh, thank you guys so much. If this did not resonate with me, with you, I was about to say with me, um, you can always get a reading with me at jenniferwalkerzen.com. Thank you guys for watching. I love you.